Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy JMF Flow bringing you in Madden 17 Nano Blitz. Be sure to like this video. Let's try to get this video to 100 likes. Be sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel. But we out the 3-4 odd again, and I just went up against this blitz called the Cover 4 Mike. Literally the most annoying blitz ever. I'm going to show y'all why. It's the most annoying blitz in Madden, bro. Like, like I don't know. It was just annoying to me because, like, it was just irritating to go up against. And I'm going to show y'all why. First of all, I didn't know. It's good run D because he would base a line. Uh, he would base a line, and then he would crash his defensive line to the middle. Then he would re-blitz that right outside linebacker. And doing this, especially in the 3-4 eye, you can't really, like, look at this front. And he would bring bo he would bring his safety down here. He would bring his safety down here. Can't run on it. I don't know what side it was coming from. And he would literally just sit like this. So if he flipped the play, they, it looks, it's a symmet look how symmetrical it is. Split it down the middle, both sides look the same. He would sit like this, and he wouldn't move his user. If he would have moved his user, I would have been like, okay, I know what side, uh, you know what I'm saying? I know where he's coming from. He just sat here with his user, so I did not know. But then you're going to see when, like, when I would hike the ball, the dude would just come through the B-gap. Or he would come off the edge. Because when I would slide, the dude, they would get, like, caught up, and he would come off the edge. And then he would do this. He would base the line. He would re-blitz that guy. And this was, like, like, when I got in third long situations. He would, like, man this guy up. He would shift his D-line to the left and crash him to the middle. And he would do something like this. So, like, he's sending five people, but, like, he would either do this to cover the flat, or then he would just use the streak. But then, like, look at that. Ridiculous edge pressure. I literally hated playing this blitz. I couldn't run the ball. Uh, psh, I was just irritated, y'all. I was really just irritated. I didn't know what side, like, the blitz was coming from, just coming through the gap. Like, if I would block a running back to the left, like, I think blocking a running back did slow it down. I'm pretty sure. Let me see. Pretty sure blocking running back did slow it down, but it was still just an annoying blitz to go against. Then if I did block a running back, he would he would literally he would literally bluff blitz this guy. Like once I start doing that, and then he that's what he would start doing. It's coming with a block running back. So I I was getting irritated because if I block block running back to the left, thinking it's coming from the left, he would just send it from the right, and it was just it's like so the setup is basically you just base the line, you crash the defensive line to the middle. Uh, you re-blitz the guy on the right. Or if you're sending it from the left, you re-blitz your left outside linebacker. If they start blocking running back, bluff blitz that guy. Use it. Like, I always just use it as safety because then you got the flat. So if you don't want to, you can use it this guy. Y'all see, like, it's an annoying blitz. That time it got picked up, I don't know how. Like I said, it's not like the most, like, cons like no blitz is really consistent. But, like, ugh, I just hate this. I just hate this game, y'all. Just hate this game. Look, he just come. I just hate it. I hated this blitz. But like I said, if y'all mix it into y'all scheme, y'all will be successful. Phenomenal run D. And it's just a good blitz. So, again, you're going to base a line, pinch your D line. Or, no, don't pinch your D line. Base a line. Base a line. Just re-blitz the guy, whoever you're, uh, who you going to call him. Whatever linebacker you're blitzing, whatever side is coming from, just re-blitz that guy. And then you can bluff blitz this guy. They start blocking and running back. If not, you don't have to. You can use this guy. Pit that guy in a spy. You can man this guy up. Oh, no. Man him up on a slot receiver, so you don't got to worry about that. Y'all just see this blitz at work. It's a real easy blitz. Nice B-gap. So be sure to like, comment, subscribe. But until then, it's your boy, J-Mail Flow, a.k.a. Mr. Let's Get It Let's.